Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q3 of the weekly contest 424, um, Zero Array Transformations 2. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord, let me know what you think about this one. So this is kind of a hard, I mean, it's definitely a harder version of Q2, but not exactly the same. So there are two differences between this one and that one. Um, so also, if you, um, I'm, I kind of drew out some diagrams of it as an explanation for that one, but, but so, yeah, so, Definitely, if you don't understand the solution, um, or if you didn't get Q2, definitely check out that video first. But yeah, but this is a variation. The first, uh, uh, the first difference is that here, instead of having um, each query only do basically count as one query, you can um, uh, it it uh, you allows you to decrement each value from zero to uh, this V value. Uh, inclusively, right? So basically, uh, at this point, I think you can do one-to-one -one mapping, uh, honestly. Because if you look at, um, uh, actually, let me pull back up Q2 real quick. If you look at this is my Q2 solution, you have this one, right? Um, and we talked about like the, the um, number of segments and sums underneath. But for, for this one, you can just change this to V. So if if that's all that is, you could change this to V, and then you change this to V, and we're done, right? So that 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 would have been done. But there's another wrinkle. There's another twist, which is that um, yeah, you have to return not just whether it's possible, but the minimum possible non-negative value of k, such that basically you want a prefix of the the queries, um, the fewest amount in which it will exist, right? So I think may I mean I think there are a couple of ways to think about this. Um, I did it in the way that is um, uh, I did it in the way that is binary search because basically I binary search for the k, right? Meaning that um, I was because if you look if you look at Q two even with the twist, um, this is just going to be O of n. T uh, plus Q, right? So I was like, okay, that's relatively fast. If you do a log K factor on top of it, or lo not log K, but log Q number of factors on top of it, it's not that bad. So that's basically my idea. Um, yeah. So here I do a binary search on zero prefix or all, all the numbers. If it's K, Q, uh, Q plus one and it's still not satisfied, then we return negative one. Um, otherwise, we do this binary search. I'm not going to go over binary search today, but it, you know, obviously you need to know it for this part. But yeah, and here, we, all we do is just look at the prefix target. And that's the only thing that changed from Q2, along with the V thing that we talked about. Um, what's the complexity here, right? Well, this is O of N, this is O of T, uh, let's just say Q anyway. Uh, and so this is O of N plus Q. And here, this is log Q, right? So this is going to be O of n plus q times log q, uh, with some parens, just to be clear. So something like this, do, 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 do. and that that's well, that's all there is for this one. And yeah, I was able to get this one way quickly ish, um, even though I kind of misread it a little bit. Um, but yeah, like I said, this part you probably should be very good about um, in general uh, for competitive programming. Binary search, you should just be strong about in general. And this part, this problem can be a little bit tricky because, well, you're combining two things. So definitely, um, yeah, make sure you practice it, uh, the components, and then when able to put them together, you'll be good. Anyway, that's all I have with this one. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. And yeah, um, remember, if you still have questions, let me know in the comments, but you can also just double check Q2 to make sure that you understand this part. I think this tr transformation is pretty straightforward um, from Q2, and then you just have to add binary search on top. So I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you think, and you could watch me solve it live during the contest now. But it is what we'll see, I suppose. Okay. Uh, okay. So this is a different problem of AVP. Left way mode at most. Okay. So it's the same except for instead of one, you have document. How is this different from before? Like, I don't know. I think it's the same. Oh.
I didn't look at the balance actually, so maybe it is. No, I don't know. It should be the same, right? Am, am I misunderstanding this? Uh, just minor difference, I think. Zero two one. Okay. This is the same problem as before. Oh wait. It, I mean, I'm returning a number, not true for us, so a minimum non what is k? Oh, after processing the first k queries. Okay, I did not read this problem at all. <clears throat> okay, I mean, then now it just becomes binary search. Yeah, okay. So it's still not that bad, but I, I can see why this is a Q3 instead. Um, okay. So it's zero. Is that return to? I always forget what the bound. I don't think the bounds are inclusive, but okay, fine. So right is doing order k, so q. Okay. If this is good, we want then now we want to try smaller. Um, the only thing is that if f mm, actually, I think we're going to do q plus 1 and then if f is equal to q plus 1 then we return negative 1 something like this sorry I'm not talking loud enough even though I'm just talking to myself um, but yeah I'm, I'm just trying to just work through the cases uh, 2 and negative 1 Feels like this should be good. I think there should be a case where it should be zero, even though I don't know if that's a valid input. But I could see that being an edge case. Okay, so that that feels good. Let's give it a YOLO. Hopefully, they make a silly mistake. Okay, that's good. <sighs> okay, Q4 only. Thanks for watching everybody. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's prom, these contests, or everything in between. Stay good, stay healthy to your mental health. I'll see y'all later. Take care. Bye-bye.